Hey guys, welcome to my channel. This is going to be the second video that I'm doing. It's a little bit different. The first one I kind of did an intro about like my chronic illness and stuff and just kind of like talked a little bit about that and informed you guys. But today I'm actually going to be doing a little like Q&A question about me and like answering just like random questions about myself so you guys kind of know more about me. So when you're watching my videos, you kind of like know what's going on. Let's dive right in. So question number one is uh, three things about myself. So first thing is I really want to go into script writing as a major when I'm older. Uh, second thing is I'm always constantly fingerspelling like everything that I'm doing. And the third thing is I really love photography and I have a little website. I'll link it below. It's Coco Bean Photography. So you guys can check out my work. I only have like a few people, but you can look at it. <laughs> Question number two, who is my favorite teacher? My eighth grade history teacher was definitely my favorite teacher. He was just so fun. He was a little stricter, but like me and one of my good friends, he called us like the smiley club because we were always smiling. We came in and like, he would just always, he would kind of wear his like pet, like what are they called, class pets or whatever. We really, <laughs> he really liked us. So it was, it was a fun class. Question number three, what would I do if I were invisible for a day? So probably what I would do is go to like a set where like they're filming or like, you know, for a show and I'd probably just go there and watch and observe because I think it's so cool. Question number four, if I could be an Olympic athlete, what um, sport would I be in? So I would probably do gymnastics just because they're like crazy. It's kind of cool to watch. So I would definitely do that. All right, question five, I think. Cake or pie? I would definitely have to say cake. I really don't like pie that much. Only like the banana cream pie and like caramel apple. I don't really like pie. <laughs> question number six, which one of the seven dwarfs is most like me? I'd probably either say sleepy because I'm like really tired all the time. Um, <laughs> it's okay though. And I would also like, I, I don't know which one I could pick. I would either say sleepy or I'd say bashful. One of the two. All right, question number seven. I think, as a child, what did you wish to become when you grew up? I would definitely say that ever since I was little, I always like said like I wanted to be a vet because I loved animals. But then as I like grew older, I realized like, oh, they have to give them shots. Sometimes they have to put them to sleep if they're like really sick. They have to like work with like surgery. And I was like, oh, I don't think I'd be able to like, be really sad. Question number eight, I think so. <laughs> okay, what is my favorite day of the week? Uh, I would either say Friday or Sunday. Friday just because like the weekend's starting and then Sunday just because I don't know I feel like it's just a good day but then then you got to go to school the next day so <laughs> question number nine if I could shop at one store for free like for a day I think it says oh no just shop for free at one store what would it be definitely Urban Outfitters I just love like all their clothes are so cute they're so in style but they're so expensive so like you would get them for free so that would just be nice question number 10 what is my biggest pet peeve so I have like two really big pet peeves I don't know why they bother me because they're really not like that bad uh, one of them is just when people like mess up the lyrics when they're singing like every single time and they're like I don't know it's just so annoying people always mess up the lyrics and I'm like like obviously I mess them up too but just like when I listen to other people I'm like no it's not it <laughs> and then the second one is probably just when people like that are like really skinny or like really nice or really just like so they just say something about themselves and they're like oh my gosh I'm so fat or something and then they're like this and I'm like what and I'm like stop or like when they're like face like they have like one temple and they're like oh my gosh and like i'm so ugly i'm like shut up like it's fine <laughs> question number 11 am i a leader or a follower i feel like sometimes in certain situations i'm a leader but and then a lot of situations i'm a follower like if i'm working on like a group project and i'm like oh my gosh i really don't know how to do this then i feel like i'm just like oh yeah 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 and i kind of follow but then if it's something that i'm really like strong at and i'm like confident about it that I kind of like step up to the plate and I'm like yeah this is what we do question number 12 who are some celebrities that I admire and that's for three so the first one is Bart Millard he's from Mercy Me and he had like a really bad childhood he was abused and like all this stuff but instead of letting it get the best of him him getting like really angry and hurting a ton of people or letting it like get the best of him even now um and let it affect his future he actually just stayed calm he was just like very faithful and he always trusted in god so he was just like moving along with that which i really admire now he's in a band and he sings <laughs> um okay next person is definitely lebron james he gives away 43 million dollars a year to help people which is crazy because he has so much money and he doesn't like He's not selfish with it and he doesn't keep it and he's not like, oh my gosh, $43 million, that's a lot of money, like, I'm just gonna see it for myself. Like, he gives it away and helps people, so I really admire that. And the third one is Candace Cameron. She's uh, DJ Tanner on Full House. <laughs> I like her because she just lives, like, a good life and, like, she's an actress, but she doesn't let that, like, she doesn't let that 
change her personality. Like she doesn't just try to fit in and stuff. She just like believes in everything um, that she was taught when she was younger and she just like lives up to that. So she's not like a bad person. She's a good role model. <laughs> Question 13, would I rather live in the past or the future for a week? I would definitely pick the past because the future is kind of like a surprise, so I don't want to like ruin it, you know? And if I end up like in the future and I'm like, oh my gosh, like, I don't know, like just something bad could happen, you never know. But if I go back in the past, I can choose where I want to be in the past. Like I could go to a really good time where I was having fun. You know what I'm saying? So like if I go back then, it, I feel like it'd just be fun to go back and relive that when you're younger. Question 14, um, what is my favorite holiday and my least favorite holiday? So my favorite holiday would either have to be Easter or Christmas. I feel like Christmas is just like that time of year, so like it's just a really good time. But then, I don't know, I just like the concept of Easter too. And my least favorite holiday would definitely have to be Halloween. I don't really like it that much. Um, obviously, you like, get a lot of candy and stuff, but um, I don't know. I just kind of don't really like it that much. Question 15, where's my favorite place that I've ever been and where do I want to go? So my favorite place that I've probably ever been to was Disney World, which is in Florida, obviously. And I was Princess Alex down there, so it was really fun. I got a lot of attention. Uh, someone asked for my autograph, never found them, but it's okay. I also almost drowned there, but like, forget that part. Just like, everything else is great. And then somewhere that I want to go is I really want to go to Bora Bora and stay in one of those little bungalows on the water, you know? I feel like that'd just be really fun and like, you could like swim with like manatees or like pigs <laughs> or stuff and like, dude, I don't know. I, I feel like it'd just be really good fun time down there. So that was my last question. I was just doing 15 and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It's just kind of like a quick get to know me, a little bit of a different version of like what I'll actually be posting on this channel. I just wanted to do something fun like that. If you guys have questions that you want me to answer separately or like if you want to DM them to me or email, um, I'll put my email in the link below. Um, you guys can just anything that you want to ask at all is totally fine. I uh, just did like a quick little one and I hope you guys enjoyed that. I had a blast filming this video and I will see you guys very, very soon. Peace. Hey guys, welcome oh, wait, to my- hold on. No. Okay. It started and cut off like a lot of your head. No. <laughs> question blah. <laughs> okay. Question 15. 15. Where's my favorite place that I've ever been and where do I want to go? So my favorite place for vacation wise that I've ever been to was probably Disneyland. Um, I was Princess Alex. <laughs> I got a lot I of attention. Right on the stand. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs>